Yo guys, welcome back to a new video. A few weeks ago, I discovered an app called Launcher for Terraria. It's basically another version of Terraria where you have uh, very much mods. I'm now going to open it up. When you open the app, you can see all those mods. You can unlock them by logging in. For example, if you log in seven days in a row, you unlock all swords and blades and edges. And all events, all characters, all festivals, and all wings. You unlock uh, when you sign in one day. And yes, th these are all the mods. I'm now going to up to start the game. It's now opening and you can see this button. You can only use that if you are in a world. So I am in a world now and the first thing I'm going to do is make it kill this one. Is make it day. You can do this by clicking on the game and then on change to daytime. Here are all the items. Uh, the wings. The festivals. The events. Here's the teleport, but you have to save positions. The items. The items, you have the blades. The pickaxes and drills, the bows and the arrows, all the keys and chests, the item summoners, uh, here are the potions, the item dice and the animals. You can also spawn in some mobs, like all the slimes. And the flying monsters. I will do that. Uh, I will choose the lava slime. Put this on 3. And press add. Now I have... This is also an easy way to get the slime stuff. I don't know if I have one on this character. No. Okay, you can also make yourself invincible by put this on and invisible and safe zone. That means everything in your range will get damage. There is a mob, as you can see by the damage. But I always put that off. Now I'm going to the dungeon. The keys. <laughs> you can get to the dungeon very fast by uh, switch the unlimited flying button on. As you can see now I can fly unlimited. So I'm not going to the dungeon, I don't know where it is, but I'll see. So I'm in the dungeon, and the invincibility is on, and my unlimited HP is too. So I can go into the dungeon, but... It's funny to beat the skeleton boss. So let's do that. Yes. One hand is dead. Second one. Yay, I won. And. I get the hand. Okay, but now I'm going into the 
dungeon. And make it okay. to uh, find some chests. Okay, I found a gold chest, but I don't want a gold chest. I found a chest. So now if I go to the items, keys, uh, and I go to corruption key. You can put this on 99 or just on 1. Then, there you have it in your inventory. Now, if I open the chest. Oh, that's nice. Okay. That's pretty decent. All good. I found another chest here and I already grabbed my uh, donkey key and now I want to see what's in there we run your gun some throw knives and a healing potion okay and this is the video for today I hope you liked it, so it's maybe a little too short, but I'll make another part to explain the other things in this one. Bye! Before this video ends, I have a little question for you. Because of the sound of the video was way too hard, I have a question for you. What do you prefer? The game music? Uh, normal music or the game sounds comment it down below and I'll do it bye